It's been uh, three years. Yes. Three years older now. Yeah. It was uh, it was the year when you had uh, the round and round. Uh -huh. Yeah, that would be uh, 1984. 1984. Quite a few videos <laughs> and a few more <laughs> albums. I forget the 10 or 12. Isn't it? You have come up with this album, which is the first uh, in uh, two and a half years. Um, yeah, it's close about it's about the close to two and a half, more like two. Yeah. Why did it take that long? Uh, well, well, we <laughs> we wanted to spend more time on this record and make it even more special than the last albums. We mm -hmm. wanted to make sure everything was right about it. Mm -hmm. It was a, a lengthy hiatus too, you know, after the yeah. last. Uh, Tour, you know, and we just I just went to an island and <laughs> stayed there for a while. Uh, didn't you know? Stayed there for a long time, and then I wrote some songs, and then we started rehearsing the stuff up. But uh, we just took our time a little more, you know, a lot more. So, yeah. Yeah. so you waited a little longer. Yeah. You waited. Right. Were there any any, any uh, new things compared to the last three albums? Definitely. Well, yeah. There's a. Uh, you know, there was a, it was a lot of variety on this album, uh, yeah, a lot I of different kind of grooves and things. Uh, one, especially, uh, is kind of has kind of a bluesy flavor to it. The horn section. That's right. Yeah. Uh, I ask you that because uh, Rat is known to be the group who travels a lot mm -hmm. and who sell albums for a long time. Mm -hmm. I mean, as a matter of fact, uh, your last album was a, a multi uh, platinum. Yeah, yeah. It did well. Yeah. Right. But uh, do you? Ever consider that particular song becoming a single, like you know, 45? No, we don't write music to become singles. We write music <coughs> to be the best, to be the best songs possible. And if one becomes a single, great. If two or more, then it's even better. For us, it's just you know, if it's compatible with what's going on today in radio, great. You know, if it isn't, we're still doing what we want to do. You know? Right. We have to enjoy it first, and in order for our audience to enjoy it, that's more most important. And we happy, yeah, everybody happy. Yeah. <laughs> How long is the is this tour? Uh, I hope to think for all year, the whole year. I'd like to end it in 1990 at home, you know, and then come back here after the U.S. too. Yeah, and another two and a half years. Oh, uh, no, I don't think I don't, it's going to be quite think. that long. <laughs> <laughs> no. Could you? Uh, Describe your uh, average uh, day uh, when you're on the tour. Mm, you try and get up. <laughs> <laughs> try to get up at try about to, two or three, <laughs> and then you go down to the arena and do a sound check at about six, five. And if you can eat dinner, then you eat, and then you play, and then you have a good time. Mm. And do it all over again. And then do, do it all over. What's the Bon Jovi song, you know, traveling from one city to city and all the audience looking the same. Uh, I mean, I was but, kind of wondering if you were feeling that or, you know. No, we wrote a song called City to City on Reach for the Sky, and if you listen oh. to the words, it pretty much tells about where <laughs> we're at. Yeah. yeah, right. Okay, thank you for dropping by. Thank oh, you, thank you, thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks.